Twelve years ago, the Mexican government spent $70 million bringing sand to the beaches, and unfortunately, that is now already gone. The power within the waves is a wonderful resource, but it also has the capacity to devastate coastlines and the communities that rely upon them. In many areas, wave energy is increasing at 1-2% to per year. Although this does not sound like a lot, over a 20-30 to 30 year period, this equates to a 20-60% to 60 increase in wave energy. The devastating implications for this are huge. At Seasail, we've come up with a solution that mimics coral reefs, nature's own solution, to grow barriers that reduce the wave's impact. Our approach is to remove the excess energy within waves, which will allow beaches and coastlines to roll back the clock and restore their natural equilibrium. By building artificial reefs that are powered by renewable energy, we're able to form rock around a steel structure upon which corals and oysters can grow. When you boil a kettle, minerals settle out to form limescale. Whilst this is a nuisance in the kitchen, in the sea, we use electrolysis to form a similar reaction that causes limestone minerals to settle out around our structure. Natural reefs can take thousands of years to form, while we're able to form a barrier within several months. The ocean has been a vital part of my life, a source of adventure, inspiration across my career. From modelling to protecting to harvesting energy and providing hopes for our ocean, this has been my life's work and I absolutely love it.